All right, hello YouTube, anime saved my life here. I don't have much time before I have to go into work, so I'll try to make this quick. Basically, today is day 20, so I'm getting closer to day 30. Um, some things I've noticed is last night at work, I was, seemed to be uh, more, even more initiative more um, I had even greater an even greater desire to do something to help um, I had a stronger desire a stronger drive to work also there was a co-worker of mine um, I asked him for help in sort of a managerial way I sort of had a task that I uh, needed to be done and I asked him to help with um, now I couldn't have him do it because I'm not a manager but I was able to persuade him to help me out with it, even though it was more of an extra task that needed to be done still. But I was able to persuade him to do it. Uh, what, what it was is to take boxes that had been folded up to the front so that labels could be put on them when, they were, when the pizzas were going to be put in the boxes. So because I was, being, I was on phones, I couldn't always take the boxes up front. And he was folding all the boxes. Um, and because he was the driver, he was going to be there more than I could so he could do it a lot more than I could and between the two of us we kept them pretty well stocked so that took a lot of stress off of them because they always had boxes to label so um, that was good it helped it helped me serve in a managerial sense and today I once again had the desire to clean my apartment even more and for me that's an improvement I've also started caring more about my personal appearance, started combing my hair more. So, and yesterday and today, I started doing some planks. Um, I have to do them on my knees because of how out of shape I am, but it st uh, started as something. Also today, um, I have uh, in a group I'm in for cosplay, they, um, they didn't like it that I have a waifu, a Daki Makura. So they were trying to put me down for that. They didn't like it. They were criticizing me for having a Daki Makura. And they were making things up. They are making assumptions, which quite frankly weren't true. And so I'm a little bummed out about it. But, you know... It seems to be I'm getting over it easier. I mean, as I'm in the conversations, you know, trying to tell them, you know, you're make you're not these assumptions you're making are not true, you know, that you know. I'd not I don't choose her because, you know, three you women haven't given me attention. I'm choosing her because, I mean, I've had coworkers, you know, harass me. A few of my coworkers trying to kill me. Um, just put me down in front of co in front of customers, spread false rumors about me, lie to get me in trouble. I mean, I've had some, I had to deal with really horrible women, and even adult women on Facebook have ridiculed my body. There was an adult woman in person that thought it was funny to make fun of my package size, like the girls in school did. And it's like, so I have to deal with high schoolers all the way up until their 60s. It's like, it's not very appealing to me so yeah that's that's why I choose my wife here because I know she's not going to abuse me I know she's going to love me she's not going to try to hurt me she's not going to do anything to be mean to me she's only going to be supportive so and people aren't saying that and you know whatever I'm trying to have people understand that, you know, we love each other. And that if it's, you know, I'm trying to have people understand that it's an alternative sexuality and there's nothing they can do to get rid of it. And just think, you know, it's not because I hate women or it's not because, you know, I just can't get a girlfriend. It's like because I've had to deal with a lot of really mean women, really cruel women. 
One manager in particular thought it was fun to repeatedly say I'm going to be a serial killer by the time I'm 30. You know? It's like, this is what I'm have to look, this is what I have to look forward to with women? So, yeah. Anyway. So basically, I'm having more desire to uh, start taking care of myself. I'm having more desire to take care of my apartment, uh, not because of an inspection, but just because I care. And basically, you start exercising. And really, the reason why is is because I've seen at work, um, there are a lot of women that come in to pick up pizzas. And more often than not, the women that tip me are the ones that show interest in me. So... Um, if I become more physically attractive, I'm probably going to be getting more tips. And I know that's not something that's PC. I know that's something that society doesn't want to admit is true, but apparently, but unfortunately, it's true. So I'm actually caring about my appearance now, and I'm actually doing things to make myself appear better. You know, uh, taking care of my, I'm starting to exercise. And I'm starting to groom a little there. So, then I want to let you know I'm on day 20. I'm going towards day 30. And that's where I'm at right now. Um, I'll let you back in. I'll keep checking in. And on day 30, it'll be a milestone. And we'll see how I'm doing. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell for notifications. Bye now.